All right, this is Sam at Cards and Spreaks. We are doing our BGS reveal for the March 22nd, 2014 submission. Sorry, February 22nd. February 22nd, 2014, so it's been about a month. Um, if you've never seen these before or you don't know what's going on, you can submit cards for grading through my website. All you do is fill out information about the card and what break you got it in, if you got it in a break. Um... And uh, I send Beckett submissions in every two weeks. And then they come back and we reveal them. So here we go. This is a good one. I think this might be the best one. Like just overall. First card is Andrew B. I'm doing these in alphabetical order again. First card is Andrew B. Well, the first card is not the best. Sorry, Andrew. Eddie Lacy, numbered 80 of 80 from Museum. It got a solid 9. Uh, I give you a 9 auto on that. I don't know. I guess because the... It goes, I guess the auto goes off the sticker. It, like, barely. Hold on. Hold on. Some kind of smear. See right there? You can't even... S there it is. It doesn't even really look like it when you look at it normally, like with the naked eye. I almost you don't, don't even notice. But yeah, it was worth a shot. I was actually you'll see later on, but I was shocked at how good this stuff's grading. A lot of them got. <laughs> sorry, that doesn't make you feel any better, Andrew. But a lot of them did really well. Nine five centering, nine five surface. See, look at you were really close. Corners and edges nine, but everything else is or the other two centering and surface are nine five. So that's a solid nine. It was really close to a nine five. So there's number one. Okay, now it starts to get serious right about now. Eric B. Wait, no, wait, no, it's not serious yet. Sorry, I jumped the gun. I don't know what I'm talking about. This is a gold Buxton from. Sterling got another solid nine. Corners had eight five. You got ten centering, nine edges, nine five surface, but corners of nine five or of eight five. Sorry, but I did get a ten auto. So that was a gold numbered sixteen of fifty for Eric B. Eric also submitted this. I think this was from Super Break. Uh, Mays and Snyder rival fence busters, nineteen fifty eight tops. Got a five five. Excellent plus. Back at vintage grading. All right, the first big one of the break, the first 10. Check this out. Wow. This card makes me super jealous. Oh my gosh. Clayton Kershaw, pink parallel autograph from 2014 Tops Tribute. Perfect 10. Centering edges and surface 10, 9 5 corners with a 10 auto. How good is that? How delicious is that? I don't even know how to show this off. Rasmus, I'd like you to tweet out some our Beckett results if you could. Do that one if you can. <laughs> no, enough of the Toledos, please. No more Toledos. That is a beautiful card, Eric B. All right, Isaac G. Submitted this Mike Glennon. Got a 9 with a 10 auto. Another close one. 9-5 centering, 10 surface. 9 edges and corners. Just needed one more half grade, I think. Would have been a 9-5 with a 10. Pretty close. I just said this is going to be our one of our best break or uh, reveals ever, and I'm like, there's only been one above nine. I think it gets better if I remember correctly. All right, Jack. Jack's got a run of cards now. Baez and Lindor duel from uh, Sterling got an eight five with a ten auto. Nine five centering, eight five edges, corners, and surface.
These are tough. Also submitted a Jimmer, formerly of the Kings, now on the Bulls. We've got a 9. Centering 10, edges 9, 9-5 nine, surface, but corners of 8-5 brought it down to a 9. It is a 10 auto. Jimmer. Right about now, Jack's probably watching this going, oh my god, not again. Not again with the terrible grades. Oh, just you wait, buddy. Just you wait. How about we start out with a Henry, Henry Eureta blue from Sterling. That's a 9-5, my friend. 9-5 centering the surface, 10 edges, 9 corners. Number 12 of 25, Sapphire Eureta blue. One nine five in the bank for Jack this week, this time. How about this? How about a purple Miguel Sano? I know he's out of commission right now, but he could still be awesome. 10 centering, 9-5 edges and surface, and 9 corners. So there we go, Jack. Two nine fives back to back. 3 out of 10 purple parallel. That's a beauty. But wait, there's more. From Sterling, Byron Buxton, base auto, 9-5 with a 10 auto. All 9-5s with 9 corners. And boom, gold Julio Urias, 9-5 with a 10 auto. 10 centering, 9-5 surfaces and edges, 9 corners. We got you this time, Jack. Making up for the last few submissions. I also had a really close call with some of these other ones. Eight five corners brought you down. Nine five centering edges, nine surface. That's a blue. Oh, this one makes me super jealous. 14 to 25. Nine of the 10 auto. <clears throat> a green Urias that got a nine of the 10 auto. Nine five centering edges, nine corners and surface. It just needed one half tick. And I guess that's it for Jack, unless there's one more grade that I forgot about. Unless there's one more. Unless there's one more grade that I maybe forgot about. Oh, oh, oh. Byron Buxton, pristine 10 with a 10 auto from Bowman Sterling. Sorry, I left one out, Jack. Forgot about this one. That is a monster. I wonder what the pop. I didn't look at the population report for this, but there can't be very many. That's a monster right there. Do it, Rasmus. Get it. Yeah. This is by far Jack's best grade, I'm pretty sure. Well, I don't I don't think he's gotten any pristine 10s, but that's like one of the best cards he's... I mean, a Buxton pristine 10. I don't know what else you could want besides that. All right, so that's Jack's run this time. Much better. James R. This one I'm kind of bummed out about. And it wasn't our fault, really. Because it's a Mike Zunino from Topps Chrome Rookie Camo. But look at this, 8-5 centering. 10 edges, 10 surface, 9-5 corners. I mean, it was money. And then centering is an 8-5. Killed it. I think we did say that during the break, that the centering looked a little off. But that's 6 of 15. Man, so close to a 9-5. Almost a, if centering was a 10, you would have had a 10. All right. Jason P had one card. Turned out well. Josh Gordon Black, one of one prism, nine five from Select. One of one. Very nice, Jason. Uh, Josh W had a Jerkson Profar from Museum, really close to a nine five. Nine five centering, ten surface, nine edges and corners. We just needed a one little half tick on one of those. So, a blue Profar, 
a nine for Josh W. Justin S. Another disappointing one. Sorry, Justin. The Derek Jeter Atomic from our last Chrome case. 9-5 centering, 9-5 surface. 9 edges and 8-5 on the corners. I'm not really sure where how that happened. I didn't see it. Didn't notice anything. I'm, not, I'm looking at it right now. I don't see anything obvious. I don't know if they... Under magnifying glass, if they see something I don't see. But... It was close. Corners need to be up at a 9.5. Get that one home. A uh, solid 9 Jeter. Still numbered 3 of 10, so it's still a really nice card. All right, Kyle B. Kyle B got all Waka. How about this, Kyle B? A 9.5. 2013 Bowman Chrome Magenta Refractor. 18 of 35. Michael Waka, 9.5. Very nice. Keeping track of the 9.5s because there's a lot. Here's a Waka from Sterling. Orange parallel. Got a 9. 10 centering. 9.5 edges and surface. It was it was all 9.5s until corners was an 8.5. That's what happens with Sterling, though. It's tough. So a 9 with a 10 auto on that one for Kyle. Here's a cool one. Heritage High Numbers Will Myers Auto. 9.5. That's tough on paper. 9.5 centering edges, 10 surface, 9 corners. That's a really good one. I wonder what the pop report is on that. I like how he signed his shoulder. So That's gorgeous. Good job. Good job right there. And does he have one more? Oh, yes. How about this? A gold cord sandbird from draft. 9.5 of the 10 auto. You had a 9 surface, but 9.5 corners ed, uh, centering and 10 edges brought you up to 9.5. That is a brilliant card right there. 3 of 50, Cord Sandberg, Gold Parallel, 9.5 of the 10 auto. Told you there was some good stuff in here. We haven't even, we're barely even starting. We're like a third of the way done. All right, Mark P. How about this nice Matt Elam? Blue Wave Auto from Topps Chrome 2013. 9.5 centering edges, 10 surface, and 9 corners. Beautiful. 17 of 50. Told you, a lot of 9.5s. We got three 10s. We've only shown two of the 10s. There's, I think there's one more 10 at least. All right, this one I was really bummed out about. An 8.5. Edges, 8. Corners and surface, 8.5. Centering 9.5? I didn't see that. 2 of 10. Onyx Giovanni Bernard from Black. But Blacks are tough. Black football is a tough grade. So, sorry about that. It was a 10 auto. Sorry about that, Mark. All right, Mark Q. Look at this. Here's a really nice Robert Woods Museum 9.5. They're, they're grading pretty well, actually, the ones I'm seeing. 33 of 50 Robert Woods from Museum 13 football. 9.5s, all sub 9.5s, and 10 surface. So that's a strong 9.5. And a 10 auto. Yeah, black's brutal. So that's what I'm saying. All right, Mark. Here is your Alfred Morris that I didn't put on the spreadsheet somehow. But I have it, and it got graded. Numbered 48 of 50, Alfred Morris from Museum. This one got a 9. 8.5 on the corners. 9.5 centering surface, 9 edges. Uh, and a 9 auto. Uh, why is that a 9 auto? Oh, there's like a big pin blotch right there on the A. I guess that's why. It's all on the sticker. That's tough. Doesn't look like a 9 auto to me. And a couple of totally certifieds. These both got 9s. Seth Jones and Cody Hodgson. Both 9s of the 10 auto. Uh, looks like corners 8-5 on both of them. So these paper... Paper totally certifies are tough. Solid nines. 10 centering, 9.5 surface on the Cody Hodgson. Nine edges, eight corners, but. Those paper corners, baby. They get you every time. Michael T submitted this interesting Topps 2003 fan favorites Alvin Davis autograph. Nine centering edges, eight corners, 9.5 service. He sends me the most interesting cards. 8-5 of the 10. 
I don't I didn't even know that card existed. All right, Michael Z. You ready for it, Michael Z? Here we go with Pristine 10, number three, if you're counting at home. Ryan Tannehill. This is a Prism's Prism autograph. <laughs> Six of 99. Pristine 10 of the 10 auto. 10 centering edges and surface, 9.5 on the corners. Beautiful. Tannehill's getting a little respect lately, too. He was a little slow out the gate, but he had a good end of the year. That is a very nice card. We might as well tweak the 10, Rasmus. I mean, why not? Number 3 of 99 on this one. <clears throat> Alright, also from Prism, but from Baseball, also for Michael Z. This Mariano Rivera. Got a 9.5, but they give you a 9 auto, I think, because the auto goes off the sticker there on the left. But solid 9.5 grade, 10 edges, 9.5 centering, corners, and surface. So, pretty nice card there. He also submitted this Carlos Correa from Prism. Um, top Prospects, Carlos Correa, 9 mint. The, the centering got you, 8.5 centering. 9.5 corners of surface, 10 edges, so it was close. Number 9 of 10, gold. Centering of 8.5. That's annoying. Some of those, it's hard to tell the centering. All right, Nick J. He's been waiting. Sent me a couple golf cards. He's been waiting for the results. The first one is a Michael Jordan from 2012 SP Authentic Sign of the Times. Man, you got a 9.5. 10 centering and surface, 9.5 edges, 9 corners. They gave you a 9 auto, though, because Jordan's auto goes off the card there on the right, off the sticker. They'll nail you every time for that. But, I mean, technically... You got a 9.5 Jordan. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. And Nick J must know what he's doing because he pulled a, a couple nice 9.5s. Arnold Palmer, Leaf Golf Autograph from 2011, Golf Medal. Arnold Palmer, 9.5 with a 10 auto. 10 centering, 9.5 corners and edges, and or 9.5 surface and edges and 9 corners. Booyah. Good job. Good job, Nick J. A couple nine fives. Ooh, here's the most surprising grade of the break right here. This is this might be the best, like, not best card, but like good job, best job. I pulled this live too. Look at this. Stan Musial Legends card from Triple Threads. It's got a nine five. You believe that? And that's solid too. Nine five centering edges, ten surface, nine on the corners. For a 9.5. That's what you got to do to get a 9.5 on triple threads because the corners are all, like 9 is the best you're going to get most of the time. But still, very nice. Nicholas S. Patrick M. Boom. 9.5 Will Myers from Finest. Jersey Auto. Number to 149 with a 10 auto. 9.5 corners of surface, 10 centering, 9 edges. Very good. See the 9.5s we're getting this time? This one is a 2001 Leaf Limited Mark Teixeira Auto to 500. Did we pull this from Super Break for Patrick? I think so. I'm not sure. Or maybe he sent it in. 8.5 with a 9 auto. 8 corners, 9.5 surface, and centering 8.5 edges. That's a tough grade, though. And Robert, I don't know if he's watching. Robert had some vintage from Super Break. Roberto Clemente, 1961 tops, got a BVG6. So, I don't know if that's good or bad. <laughs> it's a 6, though. The Nolan Ryan rookie from the 1968 Rookie Stars card got a 4.5. 1968 tops, Kuzman Ryan, Ryan rookie, 4.5. And the 1949 Bowman, Pee Wee Reese, got a three. Beckett Vintage Grading, three, very good. Very good. 
So those were Robert's vintage grades from Super Break. Oh, there's one more. He also submitted... Ah, I had an eye for this one, didn't I, Robert? You asked me to look at all of them, and I said, this one's the one. I sent back all the ones I thought wouldn't make the cut, but I looked at this one, and I was like, this one's got a shot. And look, 10 surface, 9 5 edges, 9 5 corners, 9 centering with a 10 auto. Ronid Odor for the Texas Rangers. Best name ever. Well, Rock Shoulders is the best name. Maybe that's probably the second best name. All right, Sean S. has got a grip of card. Well, basically, we're down to Sean S. and Stoddard show right now for the rest of these cards. First, we have a Danica Patrick from Five Star Racing. Got an eight. These are tough. Nine, uh, seven five corners, nine five on the centering, eight five edges and nine surface. Um, he had two booklets graded actually. If you guys want to see what the booklet grades look like or the holders, they're huge. But this is what they look like. They're monsters. Look at this thing. This uh, Jeff Gordon booklet got an eight, nine five centering. Seven five corners, eight five edges, eight surface. The one of five Jeff Gordon book. Thing is monstrous. I actually also found out they cost double, so <laughs> if you want a booklet graded, let me know. It's double the price. Um, and then we have a Carl Edwards eight of ten. That got an eight five. 9-5 centering, 9 surface, 8 edges, 8-5 eight, on the corners. And there's a 10 auto. So that's what a booklet grade looks like. Or slab, I guess, if you want to call it that. Alright, now here's a nice one. Sean, Sean's going to be happy with these. Actually, two of them. Look at this. We got twin Mike Glennons from Museum to 25 that both got 9-5s. That's awesome. Population two, huh? 10 centering the surface on this one, nine corners, nine five edges. That was close to a 10. A couple more ticks, you would have gotten it. Nine five corner surface, 10 edges, nine centering on this bad dog. Very nice. Two nine five Glennons to 25 from Museum. Both with 10 autos. But here's when it gets really good. Look at this. Sean. Numbered 6 of 15, a case hit from Museum. EJ Manuel. Patch auto. 6 of 15. 9.5 with a 10 auto. Look at that card. Awesome. I was really surprised that these Museum football is actually grading pretty well. That's an awesome card right there. Um, we got a draft Clint Frazier. Didn't quite get the 9-5. The it looks like surface was 8-5. I don't know how I missed that. 9-5 centering, 10 edges, 9-5 corners. Was, it was all ready to go to get a 9-5 and then surface of 8-5. I don't know. Maybe we should crack that out and buffer it. Buff it. <laughs> Buff out the surface. I don't know what I missed on that. 10 auto on the Clint Frazier. Uh, how about a Marcus Lattimore from Topps Chrome? Prism. Refractor parallel, I mean. 9.5 with a 10 auto. 10 centering and surface, 9.5 edges, 9 corners. Very nice Lattimore. Numbered 15 of 150. Lattimore going to come on strong next year? And this one was a little disappointing. Mike Glennon Blue Wave that got a 9. It looks like centering was an 8.5. Otherwise, you had it. 9-5 corners of surface, 10 edges. 9 with a 10 auto. 37 to 50, Mike Glennon, Blue Wave. And Sean's last one. Talk about a tough grade. Man, this is tough. 46 of 49 from Absolute. Mike Glennon, 9-5 with a 10 auto. That's tough on Absolute. And that's solid too. 9-5 corners, surface, and edges. Not like you got like 9 corners and you know blew it out with tens to make up the nine five that's a solid nine five not even a nine sub that was really good all right <clears throat> time for the stoddard show
Stoddard did pretty well. Let's start out with this Zach Stacy. Add another 9.5 Zach Stacy to the Stoddard collection from Select. How many of these do you have now? Like 50? Like 100? Oh, this one's awesome. Hopefully Jules isn't watching. Case hit. Tavon Austin, 19 of 20 from Museum. 9-5 with a 10 auto. Look at this. Look at Museum. Where the heck did Museum come from? I, don't, I bet you don't have many of these. <laughs> that is an awesome card. Oh, uh, this one kind of sucks. But these are tough. I've submitted a bunch of Kendall Wrights, and they always get 8-5s and 9s. Tannehill from National Treasures with the with the whale tail, <laughs> the dolphin tail. Nine centering edges and corners and nine five surface for a solid nine. The ten auto. Actually, it's not bad on National Treasures to get a nine. We've got a Nick Foles from Triple Threads. It got an eight five. This is a ten centering, nine five edges, nine corners, seven five surface. There's like a little ding right there. I don't know if you saw that. I didn't notice that. I didn't take. I don't take your guys' cards out of the packaging when you ship them to me. So, I don't even touch them. First one, yeah, right. Expect me to believe that. From 2000, this is brutal. From 2012 Absolute, seven on the corners. Man, there's a big ding. I don't know if you, you probably already knew that, but. 2012 Absolute, Andrew Luck, 7-5. Jersey Auto. 9-5 centering, 8-5 edges, 9 surface, 7 on the corners. They killed you. 1 of 25. That's a 10 auto, though. Here's a Tony Romo from 5-star last year. Got a solid 9. 10 centering, 9-5 surface, 9 edges, 8-5 corners. So you like to submit some tough grades. Oh, I got a 9 auto, actually. I don't know why. Man, that's tough. The auto's a little scratched, I guess. I don't know. I wish they were all the same. I hate it. I hate how some are on the front and some are on the back. Tyron Matthew. 9-5. Select gold, baby. 10 centering, 9-5 corner surface and edges. That's solid. Tyron Matthew. And... You got TJ Graham, rookie Letterman from 2012 Limited. Got a 9. 8 5 centering, 9 edges, 9 5 service, and 9 corners. This one is a good one. A 9 5. Eddie George from National Treasures. Jersey Auto. Good one. Good eye. 10 centering, 10 surface, 9 5 edges, and 9 corners. The Honey Badger. Eddie George, 15 of 25 with the 10 auto, too. Good one, Stutter. Good eye on that one. I don't know about this one, though. Jeez, what the heck? Max Scherzer cracked ice from the convention. VIP. How'd you get this? I got a six edges. I don't know what happened. There has to be some catastrophe on the edges somewhere. I don't see it. I don't even know what's wrong with this thing, but something's seriously wrong with it. <laughs> this is the worst part. Centering, corners, and surface are all 9.5s. Yeah, all 9.5s. And then a 6 edges. I don't understand what... Why? I don't even see what... It should be something just totally obvious, but I don't see it. Oh, on the bottom. I see it. It's all curled on the bottom. See? You can't really see it. Yeah, I know. On the bottom, there's a bunch of that chrome curl. All right, we've got Tyler Eifert, slideshow autograph, 43 of 100, got a 9. 9.5 nine, centering surface, 9 edges, 8.5 corners. Sorry, I'm going fast now because i got to get on to the next one. You got a 9 from 2013 Triple Threads, Triple Relic, Rivers, Matthews, and Gates. 
Uh, man, 9-5 centering edges and surface, 8-5 corners. All you needed was a 9 on corners, and we got a 9-5. Uh, Andy Dalton from Upper Deck, exquisite 2011 rookie. That's an awesome patch. Nine of 135, we got a nine. Nine centering edges, nine surface, eight five on the corners. With a nine auto, why is that a nine auto? <laughs> Man, they're tough on your autos. <clears throat> we got from five star... Russell Wilson got an 8-5. 9-5 centering and surface, 8 corners and 9 edges. 2012 5-star rookie auto patch. Russell Wilson. Ten auto. Uh, my boy Kendall Wright from Valor, 56-75, an 8-5. 9-5 centering, 8 corners, 8-5 edges, 10 surface. Valor is the most... Valor's got to be the hardest thing to grade ever. It's impossible. Oh, uh, this one bummed me out because it's a one of one tops vault, Zach Stacy. I don't even know how you got this. How did you get that? 9 5 centering, 9 5 surface, 9 edges, but 8 5 on the corners. That's what did it for you. Close to a 9 5. That would have been awesome. But I'm sure you probably just want to get that protected since it's in the vault. It's from the vault. Here's a really nice Kiko Alonso. Prism parallel. 9-5 corners and centering. 10 edges, 9 surface with a 10 auto. Very nice Kiko Alonso. 138 of 199. And here's the two that were messed up last time that got damaged. Stoddard. You got a 9-5 on this die cut camo Monte Ball and a 9 on the Tory Smith uh, Select. Prism insert. These were damaged, you know, a couple submissions ago, and they fixed them for you. Oh, the Topps eBay store. Huh. I guess that's it, Stoddard, unless I'm forgetting unless I'm forgetting something. Am I forgetting any cards that you remember? Are there any could there be any other cards that I could be forgetting? Oh another pristine ten. This time it's select. Rookie Auto Prism, Zach Stacy. Numbered 83 of 199. Is that our fourth 10? Our fourth perfect 10? Get you some, Rasmus. So, very nice. Four perfect tens, including the, the Buxton. And there was a ton of 9.5s in there. Some really nice museum 9.5s. So, I think that was one of the better overall submissions. You guys did an awesome job.